Welcome to another video on Power BI interview questions. Hope you're watching this series from beginning. The next question which you may be asked is, how do I sort a column of a matrix visual in Power BI in descending order? So basically I have a column which is let's say month year and now month year is usually is ascending sort and that too we do it by using a sort column. Now I want to do a descending sort. So in matrix visual, a column field usually sort itself ascending or based on the sort column and we want to change this behavior. Now to do this, there is no built-in option. So I don't have something which where I can go ahead and you know, say option where I can do sort descending. In case of matrix visual, we don't have many options for changing the sorting on the column fields, whether it is the order in which we wanted to sort or the columns which we wanted to choose for the sorting. So we have to do a little trick to do the descending sort. Now to do that, what you have to do is we have to change the sorting of month year column to descending using a month year sort column using the feature known as sort by column. Usually we create a rank function, basically the descending rank on the month year sort column. So usually we sort month year on the month year sort column, we create a descending rank and we, st and we start sorting using that column. But what that means is you will end up losing the ascending sort on the month year. What we can do is we can add a new column month year one, let's say first to month year and then we can create a sort on the month year sort. Now, this is the additional code assuming that you already have a table. So you can create a rank on the existing table code, which I'm going to showcase you and then month year and descending and that's because even if it repeats, we want next rank to be the continuous rank. You have to mark month year sort descending column as the sort column for month year one column. And then you have to use month year one column in your visualization to make sure that you are sorting descending on month year column. So what I will do here is I will take you through Power BI and explain you what is the question, how you are going to solve it. So let me jump out of the Power BI and I'm on the interview question files, which I'm using regularly. And you can also find this file on my GitHub account. So let me add a page. Let me call this page as Q64. And on this page, first of all, let me add a matrix visual from the builder visual and let me add category on the rows month year from the date on the columns and I would need a measure which I'm going to use net as values. As you can see the data is ascending sort on the columns and this is what we were talking about. You can see here November, December, January in the ascending order it is sort. If I go to the three dots sort by category and net so there is nothing for this month year column. I want the month year field on the metric column to have descending sort. How can I do that? So what I'll do is I'll go to my date table, click on my date table. And as you can see inside this code of the date table, this month year and month year sort. And if I go to the column tools by clicking on a column month year, if I look at the sort by column, you can see month year is sorted on month year sort column. If I only create the sort descending column using the rank and use it on month year column, I lose the ascending sort. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a little bit of modification as I've shown the code before. So first let's put this entire table into a variable. Instead of returning this table, let's in the date table, I'll now create where underscore tab equals to this thing equal to the add column. So this is the, my current code. And then I would like to return this. When I return this, I can use add columns underscore tab means whatever is there in the table as a variable tab, get that. Then I need a new column, which is month year one or month year, whatever you call, let's me call it month year one, which is equal to month year. Now I got all the columns, which I created in the previous variable tab table, wherever things I've created, I'll be able to use those. So I'm able to use this month year. I will also be able to use the month year sort. So I can create here is a month year sort one or month year sort descending also I can call the ESC. How do I sort it? So for that, I'll use rank X. Now rank X first argument, we need a table. Second argument expression third argument we can leave argument would be the order by column because we are creating a column and order by column and then type skip or dense so rank x is there and the syntax of the rank x is first we need to give the table the expression on which the sorting is going to happen third argument we are going to leave order by of that expression ascending or descending the type skip or dense that is what we need so let's go ahead and give it so table is underscore tab in this case the column which we want is month year sort 
and one thing sort is already giving the sorting ascending order sorting but now we want descending so we will use this because this is a numeric column which can provide us the sort we are going to leave the values descending so we want now to create descending sort and dense we want to get the continuous rank even if there is a repetition in the ranks this formula is completed and let's close the add column press enter now we get two columns and just to take you to the data view to see these values that would give you a little bit better idea if i go to my date table now you can see i have a month year one and month year sort column also which is descending sort previously i have month year and month year sort which i was using now click on the month year column and you will see the column tools on the top inside that go to sort by column click on that and sort it by month year sort it has been sorted you can go back to your visualization layer and in the visualization layer in the matrix visual i'll click on the arrow of month year and choose month year one column into the visualization now you can observe the descending sort order starting from november 2021 october september august july june 2021 and so on so if you have a visual where you don't have an option to sort a column you can use a column which is already sorted in the order which you want in that particular visualization and column of the matrix visual is just one example of that in this manner you can answer this question thank you for taking time to watch this video your curiosity and quest for the knowledge are what's inspiring this series if you have any question or topic you would like me to explore in this series please let me know in the comments below your support is truly means the world to us it's the reason we create and share these videos if you have enjoyed this content and would like to see more please consider liking sharing and commenting it helps us immensely until next time keep learning and stay connected thank you